Okay, ladies and gentlemen, today is December the 24th, 2021, already morning hours, 1 a.m., and I am about to present another MK Ultra proof. Simple. Uh, I did manage to identify a lady car seller. Here it is. This is the car I have just purchased. This was published on December the 17th of 2021 on Friday. Uh, this is when I actually bought a car. These are these are the locations I have gone through to get to the car. Um, right about at this location here. Yep. This is where I no longer wanted to go on the foot and I came up to here to this here to this location and that's where I took off by auto stopping and I was taken along people involved in MK Ultra all the way to a car seller uh the day I did cross about 40 kilometers on foot and uh, the car seller sold me this beautiful car the car seller is located near Zagoria Opsavi I am not going to give a precise location about the car seller I do respect confidentiality whenever I deem it's necessary uh, to protect interests of this is this is the location uh, nearby here it's 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 further but this is approximately the area so that if you were gonna go Uh, with a car it would look like something like this here that's about what is it 62 kilometers something like that actually with a car that's more than 68 and on foot because Google did deliberately guide me through the wrong uh, locations it took a little longer too he took me to the woods to the forests and actually attempted to get me through the major hill that's actually like kind of really something i was told and that's why i did go to the auto stop option uh very very bad choice if you were gonna do it because of the heart uh, this stuff was supported by a severe sleep deprivation procedure so anyway I'm not gonna waste your time um, there is some stuff I already have explained also in respect to the car about Jean Marie who sold me the uh, who sold her a car she's the first owner But today I want to concentrate on the physical proofs about my knowing her prior to the car purchase. We will get to this stuff. This car, with this car I was also taken to the Serbia. At the end of the video I will a little bit give, we'll discuss this a little bit, but right now it's a three minute long audio recording that's what I want to do I want to play with this three minute long audio recording we'll have one translated for you from Slovenian to English language and um,
it uh, just triggered a lot of memories here uh, this is this is the Frenchman who was on a Polish Hunger Games Jean-Marie Vosch uh, he was the one who also sold her the car and uh, well and that's how the MK Ultra should end <laughs> but they had so many blah blah how and when and this and that but let's go and what I am gonna do I am gonna translate you how I managed to identify her and we are just gonna count the proofs <laughs> Talking about the tires. Uh, this year, this this um, I stated that. The two of you know each other since 2002. Um, this was my mistake. This I did go a little too far with it. Not since 2002, but long, long time for sure. But not since 2002. Let me explain. Uh, the two of us are only together three years. That's basically, I don't know, since 2017 or whatever. Uh, but we know each other for a very, very long time. Two years ago, we got married. We did know each other before, but we didn't have anything together. I asked her, you know, because I do have a habit, I don't go and, uh, no, whatever, the, the, um, <laughs> I have a different approach instead, so I go, that's how you see me usually, uh, smiling too. And then I ask a question out of blue, and I did ask her, haven't you, excuse me, but haven't you worked before? for the Slovenian state as far as I remember and you also have a higher degree you're going to hear me asking also about you also have a higher degree uh, let me play this forward to you and uh, she says yeah and I said, and you have a, like a higher degree, right? And she says, yes. Now she's going to say, how do you, how do you know all that? Did you check me? <laughs> she's laughing and she say, no, I didn't check. Big mistake. No, 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 no. Uh, the son I'm talking about that he moved to Divacha. Divacha, let me demonstrate to you. Divacha, that is on the other side of Slovenia. This is a novel mister, right? And so this is a Gori Psavi. Uh, and Divacha, Divacha. Well, the best is going to be for me to just. Oh, man, it's, it's here. It's very, very close to Trieste actually to the Adriatic coast uh, wow 2002 that is crazy from my side that's crazy that is big mistake okay let me demonstrate to you again 
the memories on these people are so powerful that I'm confused with the timing. That's a divorce right here. So far, I was able to tell that she works for the government and she has a higher degree is education and she gave me a plus so that's she gonna give me a two pluses uh, immediately uh, as far as knowing each other and stuff and that and son and all this stuff okay let me explain like this let's go to the business okay the lady is originally Originally, she is from Maribor City. Uh, she is not even from Ptui. She got married to Ptui. And what exactly is the thing? The thing is, oh, let me demonstrate you where Maribor is, where Ptui are. That's completely on the other side of Slovenia from where I am located. That's actually quite far, look. That's a toy right here, you see. Ah, what's going on? This here, this is a toy. This is where I also have relatives. A sister from my mother moved here to Ptoy. That's about 110 kilometers from here. And Maribor, that's just maybe a little further. Um, no, let's see that stuff. That's like 100 and 1500 and something kilometers from Novo Mesto. That's where I have the aunt from my father. So I kind of have relatives all over this Slovenia, <laughs> you know. But anyhow, okay, let's uh, let's finish the business. I was crazy about her. Sometimes in 98, this lady was still single in Maribor, and she did go to the discoteca, yeah, uh, in Maribor city, disco dancing, disco dancing, tim 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 and I was insane about her, uh, so insane that Merkel resented me and some other females resented me. And uh, then there was this guy from Ptui. I also didn't know what to do with him. He also was a nice guy. This is what I was brought from the U.S. drugged up to Slovenia. Again, I not I shouldn't be in Europe anywhere between uh, 95 and mid 2006. I shouldn't be anywhere on a European continent, absolutely anywhere. Yet I was drugged up and brought along American presidents. American politicians, British, through the Britain, if you like, Germany, time and again also to Eastern Europe. Slovenia is just a number one spot where we would come. Melania Knauss, same age as, as I am, just 20 kilometers from here. Um, And no wonder this was a number one stop, number one location, Slovenia right here. Brought time and again to Slovenia. And uh, it just happened so that um, they were looking for female for me, uh, not really. I got in so many fights because of the females that, boy, you couldn't even count uh, how many times. Drugged up. Uh, and in 98 she was still single and there was this guy, a very nice guy from Ptui. Uh, I didn't know what to do with this guy really, but he was so nice. He was very nice, always with him, it was always very good. And it was like, a, it, it appeared to me, they did, he did, I don't know, I think they did, somehow government did, they put the two together. It was a really match in heaven, I think. That's how I felt about either one of the two. I liked either of the two. Um, except that when the women are in the picture, I become obnoxious. When I was drugged up, 
I had as a main interest or cars to me <laughs> women watches and stuff like that you know uh, fishing and stuff um, pretty much did whatever I wanted to felt like I want to do <laughs> uh, joke aside you know then in 2001 I experienced that exactly the same moment I had going on with Prince William and Prince Harry Charles father the same the same the same almost I felt funny man the same the same moment this is a light-skinned guy this is her husband, original husband. Um, I remember these kids running around, and they were kids or small kids. They were smaller than uh, when it all started, I think, with a Harry and with a William. And so it kind of reminded me of that. I think she had two kids. She has two kids, she has two children. It's not only the son, it's one more child. And I think that's a girl. And um, they moved. She used to be in an apartment, I think, in Maribor. She also has a brother, I think. And uh, they moved to Ptui location uh, to a husband. Lived in a house. I remember how he fixed the house uh, in 2001 the kids the kids were like I don't know I'm probably three four years old something like that uh, as soon as the two smelled one another it was obviously immediately you know what I'm trying to say and uh, marriage and all that stuff uh, there is a possibility that man is even a police officer he's either a police officer or he does have a four-year high school program either four-year high school program or three years uh, uh, program or is a police officer I remember that much too this is quite a light-skinned guy um, nice good-looking guy was strong but he got intimidated more and more and more by the neighbors he got into a bigger and bigger trouble because of me then over the course of the time I presented more and more what is what equals to a trouble so you want to know about whether I know these people or not, you can just go and you can just count yourself how many proofs I gave you right now. I know them in depth. All the dealers, everything she mentioned that they use, this was just one proof after another, one proof after another. I could go about every one of them and talk. The sun, sun is probably, according to what I stated right now here, about 24 years old, I estimate. So this, I deeply made a mistake about this divacha. This is, this is just a mistake. But I actually estimate that he moved down there, in my opinion, in 2015, if not 2017, 2015, that was, uh, and are they talking about some, uh, mistake I made asking her about that, is not being there for so long, not that long, because this is the thing, this is so much, I recall so many things about this one. This was one of the most, I don't know, the one who subjected me to this stuff in question concerning her 
was using the worst drugs possible. Whoever was doing this stuff, uh, I'm going to tell you that <laughs> the drugs that were used, this, 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 this stuff would kill elephant. This, cause this stuff was an elephant killer, whatever was used. What I can tell you about this gentleman here is that in continuations you about to hear, he mentions Chertalich. A Chertalich is an individual that I already have explained about was involved in MK Ultra. One of the main reasons was his father, because of whom partially I did immigrate to the United States of America, because the local state employment office conditioned me marriage to his daughter. Life through marriage with his daughter, either this or on psychiatry already, prior to my departure to the United States of America. This is, this is, this is a Serb-Slovenian family that has a personal, as a person, one of the personal friends, a protector in Slovenia, no other than Aleksandar Vucic, who is a president of Serbia today. With the car that you have seen, I was thinking of the Serbia. In fact, everybody knew about her, everybody knew about this car. It wasn't only Jean-Marie Valls. Uh, I demonstrate here also. I point out here the guys I was with. I can give you a good background about these guys, how they started. Uh, this guy, uh, he was this, I, I might have actually even made a mistake because it wasn't only one. One started in 98 and then there was another one who started like in 2000, 2001. So this guy definitely, the house was from the father. I remember when I came with him and he started to fix the shop for himself. This guy here, this is a Serb, I believe, from Bosnia. And this is the stuff already I pointed out, but I was shocked the other day as I walked through the city and I met another guy and so on and so forth because all these people knew about this stuff. Bojan Čertalić, son of Jozef Čertalić, let me demonstrate to you. This is the guy right here that you see, and you can see the sister. This is a, such a bunch of hypocrites that I, uh, I think I'm just gonna take their company away from them. I think, throw them in the jail or something like this, and pick up whatever they have. Basically, I'm gonna do something that they're not gonna like at all. Because, you see, I don't like the hypocrites. I hate hypocrites. Likely very much. Sadly enough. Um, right there, that's his wife. Uh, I, I don't understand. She is um, a Serbian, I think. Um, you see, the thing is that this guy, this guy is a swinger. And when I was younger, his wife, his own wife, kind of flirted with me. And I like her. I frankly didn't have any kind of problem with this stuff, with this Serbian or whatever. You see, the thing is that um, I just... Um, I just don't like being pushed around. That's one of the things. You see, the problem they had, they had the problem. You see, if I like, I like. And if I don't like, I don't care, regardless of uh, how much money the person has. Is that many of these people that met me over the course of the years, they can confirm this. For me, it's important when it comes to such issues that it's something I like. I don't like being pushed into issues that I don't have, I don't feel for. 
when it's concerned uh, a sexual attraction, love, and this kind of stuff, this is very, very personal. I deem the most personal stuff that money cannot buy. Uh, this guy was so obsessed with me. Well, he would go over the MK Ultra book. <laughs> this is not a Harry Potter book. This is a real book that exists on this black market that people involved in MK Ultra had access to. And through those pages, they could go and they could contact with, find out about people from elsewhere. They shouldn't be, I think, doing this kind of stuff, but this guy was really doing this kind of stuff. He secured himself a contract, all kinds of stuff, and in Italy, uh, he got a plane, literally, in front of his company over there in, Shma in uh, Dolenska to Plitza, through me, every time using these contacts, and he got, literally, with this couple, and he enjoys swinging all over Slovenia. He liked uh, sexual orgies and beatings and have abused me he tried to push me into a relationship with a Serbian woman he insisted on abused, guaranteed me but this is very bad stuff because his father did something very bad then this is his son continued even worse after he already immigrated to the US eventually they got him you know that picture screen from that uh, Norwegian painter they got him they ambushed him one of the people who ambushed him was a police officer that's the lady I bought the car from they told him no more as far as beatings, abuse no more physical violence on me here in MK Ultra. He didn't know what to do. Heavily smuggled money to Serbia to his godfathers over there. Contemplate on escape to Serbia. Created the plan to escape to Serbia if necessary started to insist that somehow, no matter what, that I am going to get married with one of his uh, children, Shintirnei, Boyan Shintirnei, transport, your transport, you remember what you did there, and uh, threatened me through the local state employment agency, block me from employment through the local privatized private uh, companies maybe even association of private employers like himself from employment so that he could regardless get <laughs> basically me killed through unemployment and with the help of Kirka Pharmaceutical that would also give him a support and guaranteed me I wouldn't find employment all the way to first what they claim was Ljubljana, then it was Sally, then they came up with idea through their HR department claiming me in the face in front of Kirka Pharmaceutical it's not going to be even in Maribor anywhere in Slovenia for that matter <sighs> got himself in his own shit up to throw it in the bowl. Uh, so the gentleman is going to ask me where I know him, but I do want to buy this car. I really do that day. So I didn't want to know anything about him. Also, hell yeah, I remember that too. Um, I could write a book on this case alone. I think so let's just go and I'm going to play you the rest of the audio recording so that you can hear this yes of course you just no yeah of course this is the way it is yeah I am <laughs> <laughs> okay let me play yeah, this again yeah. 
А ние са ли неки там неки за не вен неки държава, неки дела, да, ние са неки така. Мата едно више за дразбо, не? Я, не? Не, не, нисам вас преверил, не, 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 стоп, не. The information to make myself clear about Maino and about her, she's going to explain in continuation working for the police and uh, having a higher degree as far as education. It was all she. She was the one who was dedicated to me. She wanted to help me at all the costs. And it was very difficult for her to help me out because of environment in Aptui, where she moved to, uh, because of the environment in Slovenia alone, because of, there was nothing in this world that wasn't guilty. I was known as a Nazi, as some kind of Nazi. That's what Borod Pahor, that's what Milan Kuchan created out of me, was some kind of monster with idea to scare the shit, to scare the shit out of Slovenian people enough that so they alone would want to run back to Yugoslavia. They scared the shit out of them in Slovenia and abroad in Italy and in Austria. This is why at times it was a little, it felt a little different than help but she kept me in mind. My God, she kept me in mind. No, 2015, 2017, I would say, 2015, 2017, for sure, because I remember. I'm trying to negotiate, whatever, 450. Okay. 500, that's it. Uh, this is not the whole audio recording. The whole audio recording is like, maybe, I don't know how long it is. Is it maybe eight hours? I don't know. Maybe, maybe eight hour long audio recording. It's a little bit long, so I extracted important stuff. Yeah. <laughs> <laughs> This is a sticker that she has on a front windshield. The sticker always is going to stay up there. It's some kind of blue sticker. Yeah, and I said, this is, this is, uh, and, uh, and I said, what is this? I said, no, please don't take it off. I want the car from you original, just the way it is. This is a veteran association of Slovenian police officers, she tells me. She was a police officer. She worked for the police. She says you can use this to bail yourself out sometimes. <laughs> I said I don't. She wouldn't give that sticker off and uh, I, I do want to abort her because she more than deserved it. Say it super. Yes, I I take it as it is. Oh yeah, yes, here from no Mister. Yeah. He asked me if I know uh, Mr. Chertalic. Yeah, yeah. Yeah, this is this is precisely this man here. Um
this is exactly this guy here. Make no mistake about it. I used to work inside of this company for his father. What I can tell you, even the state subventions uh, pay through a local employment, state employment agency disappeared from what otherwise should be a pay. That's all I can say. And this for about 60 to 80 hours of work per week. And you're not talking about some kind of, uh, you know, any kind of work. I'm just going to put it this way. It's a very demanding work. Uh, that's how he made his fortune, I suppose, too. So he just mentioned me. He just mentions me. This him. I don't want to have like I have stated. I don't want to have anything to do with with a church right now. Uh, I want to get a hold of this car. Uh, anything, you know, other stuff. It would just be not a brightest thing for from 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 my side to. This is a Gori Opsadi here, did you see this final destination I was brought by the people who participated in MK Ultra. But the day I started at 11 o'clock at night, and then I walked all day long, and as you see here, was half 12 o'clock almost, I arrived at this Gori Opsadi, a very beautiful place. What I can say is, um, along the way, you know, um, I have met, as I said, really interesting people. I saw the young man. Uh, let me see if I can. You know, I was brought here so many times over the course of the years, also by Americans, British, along. And this is where you take okay. the final shot at Zagoria. Uh, that's a cross section right there. Let's go to the back. This here, you know, mm, this is place for the gardening. They sell here flowers and stuff like that. Hey, 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 hey. Here I came in uh, 95 the first time, you know, you, did, did you hear me what I said, 95, 96. I went to United States in 95. I work aboard, aboard an American cruise liner, Meridian, overseas, for Bahamas registered company, Celebrity Cruise Lines. I shouldn't be anywhere in Europe in between 95 and uh, mid-2006, that's for 11 and a half consecutive years. I shouldn't be anywhere in the United States of America. In fact, with exception to Ecuador, where my wife is from, on two or three occasions I traveled on my own. I shouldn't be anywhere else in the world. I did not exit the United States of America on my own, ever, never ever on my own, for everything, for every trip, whatever that trip was, I'm here to testify, and it was also nowhere entered inside of my passport or anywhere for that matter, it was a hijacking, it was a rendition, extraordinary rendition, abduction. But this place, I can tell you, in 95, 96, these people started. I remember them. There was nothing, none of this stuff you see right there. And so, it was the latest that, none, none of that house, and, and we would be standing here and looking at that. Uh, first of all, why were we here at this place? Yo, this is this here. This is a Milan Kuchan. 
This is a Milan Kuchan, and this man wanted to make a fortune with me. He he was sure that I'm a slave, that I'm his slave, that I'm animal, that I'm less than animal, that he can do with me whatever he wants, foremost for the cash, that he could use me to, to grab a cash from the West, that I'm now his personal property, slave. And so... He was behind from Slovenian side those abductions, hijackings and torture. And the men from Americans to rather than to take a short trips around here around the house to also take me toward his um, family. Now you're talking about Lithia. Gabroka. This I have to see why why did indicated me this here. I am gonna check that once I'm done recording the video. It's, it's just too much stuff. This place here, Litia, this Litia here, uh, the, the farm, what he stated me was his sister. But as far as I know, um, the sister from, not his sister, but uh, from his wife's sister or whatever, he had a family here and he had another family here closer or something like that. And then he had... Uh, from his wife's sister, Hilda Toshak, that's the like abode at Salia. We walked all the way up there because of his idea that 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 he wanted me, he wanted to, uh, you know, he just wanted the cash, do it. He didn't care about shit. That's what he wanted. He wanted the money, he wanted the easy way money, and he also demanded for me to invest the money to which U.S. government have even obligated itself that would invest. It was a company in Gabroka. Okay. So, that's how the hell I know all this stuff, all this area, the city, Trebnya here. I know, like, I would be almost like a pioneer of Trebnya, more than the people that live there, how the city developed, because we walked right through here. You see this place here, Hudeya. So this is a Gabroka here. Velika Loka. All this here, uh, Roma people used to live here like a cowboys in these hills here. Like a wild west it was here. And we would go and visit them. Um, they would bring me there. Sometimes it was crazy because you dropped up the dogs are barking and you get really nervous. Keep in mind that in Poland, in Russia, they used dogs. They would have a dogs that, that would you would be drugged up and they would use dogs that they would launch at you and they would hold them on the leashes and stuff like this. They use this kind of stuff among beatings and stuff like this. So this Roma people sometimes because of these dogs and stuff they were also misunderstood. But you know, you're not gonna explain this stuff to the person that is dropped up that goes through so much stress. But anyhow, they implemented this kind of stuff against me later also in Slovenia. Once they learned where they were doing other stuff, rather than to help me out, they started to use stuff like this also against me in Slovenia. Maybe this was a Slovenian solidarity with the Polish. Hey, it's just too much for me to talk about this stuff here. Since I uh, started the subject on this issue here, um, there was always a question they were asking me, what about the parking lot? What about the parking lot? Was parking lot here or was not parking lot here? What about the parking lot? The parking lot, I think, 
Okay, it's my bet. Right now, listen, I'm not even... I didn't pay attention to this. What I can tell you is the this challenge that you see right there, this was something that... Obviously, the barn always was there. But it's renovated. It appears renovated. It doesn't matter. The chalet appeared over there, I think, like in 2001, something like this. And the parking lot, I would say, this was like the first thing I think they did here. Yeah, you know, that probably goes all the way to like maybe 98, something like that. That's basically the bet I would give you. But, completely sure about the parking lot. I'm, to be honest with you, I'm, I'm, I'm even not sure about the parking lot. I would say 98, 99 parking lot. But if I would look better, the possibility has it. There is no possibility. This is the only possibility I give. Charlotte, uh, so that this, this barrack here that you see this from this garden center, 2000 and, or 2001. Uh, first was a parking lot, then this thing. But I remember this, this place here, this was just a place. Yes, there was no parking lot. This was just a field, a plain field it was, without fence, without anything, ladies in 95 and 96 were doing this stuff you know that's how this whole thing came about uh, so what is it here with this stuff here let me let me see this here real fast there you have some houses there I didn't take time to identify that let me see uh, ladies and gentlemen uh, it would be very difficult for you to prove shit to me in respect to this case because I could almost go from house to house if I was to walk through a certain area and I did I think it was the second day look that I posted the information on this company here on Galbroka this memories and this stuff this is such a intense stuff that um let me see something here. What is it? Here, oh yeah, Presat. This company here. This is the company, they, the US government was gonna give me about $500 million in cash so that I could hand it to the director from the company. He demanded the money from me, basically came in my face, told me what I'm gonna do for him and this like a, like a shit, like an animal. Like this, they treated me. And the U.S. government was interested in paying this ransom just so they could get rid of my case. They told me that there are going to be like two installments like this and then that's it. But I wouldn't take this fucking money because these were the people I was running away from. These people even called me a traitor. Here you have everything I have written down. This was in December 19th, this was two days later. Yeah, where the hell would I know all this information, this kind of stuff? No, I was all over Slovenia. I have seen stuff. Here the Toshak houses from Milan Kuchan and his relatives. Yes, I know, I remember this stuff. Yeah. What is it? Let's see this stuff here. This here, this is, uh, to tell you the truth, it's some kind of someone's sister is from maybe from his side of the family or is it from uh, wife's side of the family? Here. Right where it says right here, this uh, 
I can tell you all about the history of this company here, for instance, so Machen Transport, how he came about it. This was involved, this was a farmer, he was, he was involved in, in this case, since the company, his company, his company was nothing when I came here. The Kuchan's relatives, but this was something like, let me see, something, something about in this area, something like this. Something here. Machen transport. Let me see, they, they told me, don't even come close here. If you come here, we're gonna, I don't know, beat you up, kill you. This is the way it was. And then it wouldn't take me here no more. I would have to go over here because I would identify how businesses and houses here I could tell over the course of the time how they developed this is the location we would visit time and again and so on and so forth so there you have it what I am going to do now ladies and gentlemen what I want to do is I want to thank you for watching this video let me play this audio all the way to the end. Oh, I did. I don't think there's anything else interesting here. Okay, Chertovich, yes, knows him. Yeah, he is talking about knowing him through the business relations, and that's about it. Thanks for watching this video. Uh, again, I am going to go ahead and I'm going to play you this audio one more time. And there you have, this is just one more proof about MK Ultra. Through the Chertelich, I was going to finish this. This couple stated, you can meet anyone, any, whoever you want in Serbia. He knows everybody. Chertelich, Alexander Vuce is like a godfather of Chertelich. A mother is from Serbia, a father is here from Shintarne, Jozef used to be his name. No, 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 these people don't know anything about this stuff yet. Uh, it was Chertovic, actually, who, even that he was well known all over the place, who got connections through me this is how it all was this is the way it was this stuff uh, including the connections in Serbia he got through me this they know a lot they have seen a lot but had not seen anywhere near as I have experienced when I was drugged up anywhere from Serbian part of Bosnia all the way to Montenegro and uh, all over Serbia <laughs> you name it you name it uh, let's go let me go and play uh, the whole audio again uh, thanks for watching this video till next time audio in Slovenian language I'm going to play one to you again so that we'll confirm another car seller identified and more than car seller just a car seller more than car seller uh, Yeah. 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 Yeah.
Was sind Sie für Sie können? Also, wo das Zelt dann wird, wo die Wache wird, wird Lehrzeit noch sein. Du wirst nicht mehr gehen. Du hast diese zwei nicht gehört. Wenn ich sie jetzt kurz, du bist, naja, auf Kurs, nicht um weiter. Ja, nein, nein. Ja, nein. Zuerst zu Pädersen. Nein, ich bin nicht so gut. Ja, zählen Sie da alle Schäste. Ja, ja. Okay. Ja, ja. Ja, ja. Ja, ja. Aha. Vou pôr na tua porta uma vez na dora, se fala, né, Paulo? Que é que eu fui? Não, é grande, é bom. Não, 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 próximo, não. Próximo, não. Próximo, não. Próximo, não. Próximo, não. Próximo, não. Não, 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 Ne, ne, jaz tako kavo pijem, mislim tako. Tako je bilo zloga mesta. A ja, jaz pa sem dovolj nešče. Ja. Ja. Četa liča poznate? Četa liča... Četa liča odvetnika, pravde? Ne, on je bil... On je bil firma. On bo to firma firal, ne? Mi se tako zgleda, ne? Ja. Ja, njega poznate? Ne, iskri delo, so one velike delo. Iskri? Ja, iskri delo, 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 iskri Uh, had the audio everything is authentic maybe maybe the only thing I would add to all this for me to say the car was sold for 500 euros it was all kinds of stuff um, involved they wouldn't want me to buy this car no matter what Serbs claimed they Rewinded mileage backwards. Don't even bother with it. Uh, the car is no good. I don't know what. <laughs> uh, Germans. That's a, that was interesting one. Uh, she's gonna sell you a lemon car. Uh, the problem with a transmission. She will not allow you to drive the car, and so on and so forth. Um, a lot of stuff, a lot, a lot of stuff. That's basically if it was Germans. Uh, this, the, the person who talked about that kind of stuff again was Ursula von der Leyen. Then the yesterday I did go around the police station here in Olmesto and I hear the squeak of the car. And it was just an hour earlier I met the guy who was a mechanic who came again, involved in MK Ultra here from Shintiane area. Uh, since he was a young kid, I already posted on my new site. For whom they claim that he's going to be one who's going to destroy me a car and do me, I don't know what, uh, all kinds of stuff like this. He came to meet me second time already at a PCT testing station that's basically for the COVID-19 tests where you get written proof that you are negative for the test and so on and so forth. All kinds of stuff like this and that I have to change immediately the oil from the car or the car engine is going to fall apart and stuff like this. 
the lady gave me a car with a brand new tires, winter winter tires, a big profile on them, and uh, also four already mounted on wheels, also summer tires, but not new, used, I think, I don't know, three seasons or whatever, but this is really generous. Uh, she, in 2017, when she learned that all these years, this is how I was jacked up. I again in 2017, I again expressed uh, feelings for her. <laughs> she did go, she rushed to a mechanic despite what this man told her not to. Uh, and she did some extra on the car, thinking of me. So I just uh, want to thank her for the sale. And I promise her we'll keep this car with me. Uh, hope will pass one onto my own children one day. So as the main price, as the main cost. The uh, Russians that did try to well, it rehearse this trip to this car on foot. I must say I did bigger and much more demanding stuff. Uh, but they rated this something as like a top stuff, something and so on, that uh, if I would do something like this, they would even take my side against the Putin and so on. Like the thing is that um, it was a Friday when I went to purchase this car, and I was sure it was a Saturday. And uh, Google, it was also on the way back. This is another video, I have to put it on. The GPS took me to Cahoots, took me to locations where we, where I would go over the course of the years, I would, they would take me for a walk during MK Ultra, and I was sure it was a Saturday, and on Saturday the offices are open, state offices are open until like 12 o'clock or something, and when I started, when I lost like three hours probably doing the stuff I shouldn't be doing, all over the place I lost my cool and that's why I did go to the auto stop especially once it directed me through uh, through that hill and so on otherwise I would just do the whole thing on foot but that's all there is in respect to this there is a lot of stuff and so on okay thanks for watching this video till next time bye bye